What's your What's your last name? Sakim. Sakim. Okay. All right. I'm gonna have you go and step out the vehicle for me. She's gonna come and get me. Yeah. So you're about 57 minutes away from me. I was almost at the hospital. All right. Okay. Let's take this off. Um. Just uh. Yeah, just send me what the information you put in your in your GPS, because that way I, I didn't go. the same thing. I don't know the name of this place right we'll, here. We'll, we'll get it figured out. We'll text it to you. It's Prince, Avenue. Prince All Avenue. All right, Prince so here, here's what's going to happen, Sakim, okay? Mm -hmm. um, unfortunately, I'm going to have to place you in the custody today, okay? You're going to go down to jail. Oh, no. you got to get booked in. They're going to take your fingerprints and picture, and you'll get a bond. But because you're driving on suspended license, you gotta go down the jail. So I did not know. I have children, I have a sick uncle, and I run the household. I got you. No, I really we, don't. We don't have a choice at this put, time. Please so we're put placing you in arrest. Go ahead and turn around and put your hands on your back, please. Please put your hands on your back. Who set the phone up on the car? They put me under arrest right now. They, I don't know. For driving with suspended license? Listen, driving with suspended license. I didn't know. And, 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 it's, and it's not even showing. Unfortunately, the law is different here in Georgia than it is in South Carolina. If you have a suspended license, you have to go down to the jail and get booked in. Okay, but, but, sir, can you speak to my aunt? She has. Yeah, we're on speakerphone. She can okay, hear us right now. Yeah. No, please speak to her. Yeah. Please, please speak to her. I'm the only one that can help with my uncle that's sick and I see you right now. Gotcha. I'm sorry about that, but unfortunately, it's not. Please, sir. You're driving please. a car without valid insurance. My son. Oh, yeah, got, you got that yes, taken care of. Got, you're already driving a car without valid insurance. I won't drive. My cousin. You can't trust him to drive to drive. No, I swear to you, I'll walk away from my car. So we're going to walk you back to this please. other car. Please, sir. Yes, sir. We're gonna walk you to my daughter's car. Come on, sir. Come on. Please, my aunt is old. She's 80 years old. Sir, please. Do you have anything I, on I will not. Poke I swear, you can. Please check me. Okay. Please check uh, everything on me. I'm gonna search you and send to arrest. Huh? See which is emergency 911. Yeah. Face towards that for me. Okay, sir. Separate your feet out okay, for me a little bit. Yeah. Nothing in your pockets, sir, right? Sir, please. please. What all do you need out of your car? Sir, I have a child at the house that they cannot take care of. I what have, all do you need out of your car? Sir, I beg you. I what? beg of y'all. I will not touch my car. You can take my keys out. What all do you need out of your car? Uh, I don't need. I don't need my family. That's it. Table. I do for my entire car. So I do for my. Sit for. I'm sorry. Thirty four thirty. I do a seat for me, sir. I Easiest do. way is to turn and face towards me and then sit down in the seat. Slide your legs in. Sir, I do for my entire family. Okay. Well, do I you know? I'm. I don't have a choice here, man. I'm telling you. That's I, I told you, job. I was not going to get in my car. We I don't swear have a to you, choice. I wasn't going to get in you my car. You have a suspended car. license. You're driving a car without insurance. You've got that taken care of. I've been doing it every you day. you suspended registration. <laughs> you so you have to go down to the jail and get booked in. Just take your photograph. They're going to take your fingerprints. They'll give you a bond amount. You can bond out, and then you can get on the way up to the hospital. But you can't drive. Sir. I, I so have a seat for okay. me, please. Okay. Okay. May I speak after you? Have a seat for me, please. Are you going to sit down, and then I'll listen to you. Okay, so what do, you, what do you want to tell me? On, on everything, my aunt just had a stroke. My uncle just had a stroke two and a half weeks ago. Yeah. I'm here helping my family. No, I don't even know who that. can come and bomb me out. I don't even know who can come and bomb me out. I'm not a criminal. I'm not a crook. I'm, if you, I look I mean, how old you, I am. Did you get a ticket or something? I didn't get take care of? I I mean, why would they suspend your license in South Carolina? That's, I just found out speaking to the deputy. Yeah. I just found out that maybe when we had a car that I had that got repossessed, that yeah. I didn't take my name off of it. Okay. Um, I, mean, I wouldn't imagine that they'd suspend you for a repossession. But that's what I'm saying. I did. I don't. But but it's no no information is coming up. I won't drive. I will, I'll have my cousin. Can you slide your legs in for us? You're not going to speak to me. No, unfortunately, I told you. I've already explained my position. To oh, you. this hurts. I don't have a choice. Sir, sir, I. Have, uh, sir. Okay, so. The way you're sitting right now is not a good position. You're a tall guy. You got long legs. Can you slide your knees over this way and sit at an angle? Okay, I'll check it right now. I'm going to come to the other side. Watch your knee. Uh, oh. 
So can you mind putting your headphones in your little black pouch? Ma'am, y'all really, y'all gotta please make sure my aunt is okay. She's 80 years old. She's 80 years old. I see for the whole house. I shop, I do everything, I do everything in the house. Do you need anything outside of your car? Um, just, just know that I, can you speak to my aunt? She, just, we have a speech. Uh-uh. Just, just speak to my aunt because I do everything for the house. I okay. Shop. I, I do everything. My son is there. He's only 13 years old. He doesn't not. He does not know what's going on. This is this is. I don't. Can you let my cousin know wherever it is I'm going? Can you let them know where it is going? Yeah. So when you get there, you'll be able to call him. How, how can I call them? When you when they book you in, they'll give you some phone calls, so you can call them. Yeah, All right. Yes, because I, I don't. Yeah. Why? I thought she was gonna let me just let my cousin pick me up. Why did this happen? I'm I'm so sorry. People, deputy, so many people rely upon me. You do not know. You can look. You can get in and get out. All right. I can get in and get out. Yeah, like they'll book you in. If you have somebody that can bond you out, you have a preset bond, so you can bond out of jail. You don't have to wait to see a judge. Well, how much is that? Uh. I'm not quite sure. They'll give it to you when we get there, okay? We'll work with you, all right? We'll try to get you out as quick as possible. Man, this is, my uncle is, is sick. All right, well, we the quicker check. we get to jail, the quicker you can get out, okay? Doors are all locked, all the windows are up. All right. Cool. What is it? I've never been to jail in my entire Okay, all right. It'll be fine, I promise. All right. Here? all right, we got to get you to the jail. Oh, man. All right. Oh, eight five zero. Thirty-six in the Show me an route to the jail. We'll one mail to ninety-five. Beginning miles. I'm ready. Go ahead. Nine eight seven zero three. Nine eight seven zero three ten four. I 
I just have to go by what the law states, okay? Yeah, absolutely. And I and I and I I believe you. I believe you are helping your family. But I I have at the end of the day, I have a job I have to do. And I appreciate you being cooperative. Okay. I'm afraid because my my uncle is in the ICU, and I'm the only one that goes and checks. Okay. The only one that's in my household. I take care of my 13 year old son there. My cousin who is 60 years old. Her mother who's 80 years old. I do all the runs for the house. I do all the cooking. I do all the cleaning. I don't even know how my cousin who's visiting because her father's in the hospital. She's in New York. She lives there. It's going to get to the place to find me. You said she lives in Conyers? I live in, she lives in Conyers. Okay. No, I, that's what we're saying. I, I stay in Conyers since I've been back up with my family.